Hello everyone and welcome to the Excel Hub. Today I'll be showing you how to create a random password generator in Excel like this one here. We will start by entering our password inputs, in other words the characters we want our password to include. We will then perform intermediary calculations to retrieve the random characters adjusted for their text case. And finally we will use the concatenate function to bring these characters together and return our password. Our password will consist of 45 inputs, including letters, numbers, and symbols. To start, let's input all the letters in the alphabet. We can do this quickly by first typing the letter A, and in the next cell use the char and code functions to return the next letter after A. We can then toggle this down to retrieve the remaining letters. Let's now add the numbers 1 to 9. Finally, we can add some symbols to make our password even stronger. Next, we can move on to our intermediary calculations. Firstly, we want to obtain a random number between 1 and 45, which we will use later to match with the applicable characters. To do this, we can use the randbetween function. We can then use Control r to bring this formula across. To prevent these random numbers from updating as we edit other cells, we can copy them and paste only their values. We also want to randomly assign certain letters a lowercase and others an uppercase. In other words, if a random number between 0 and 1 is greater than 0 0.5, then we want it to return lower. If not, then return upper. We can then once again paste only the values to prevent these numbers from updating. Next, we will use the VLOOKUP function to find which characters match the random numbers. We first input the value we are looking up, which is the random number. We then select the INPUTS table, adding absolute references to ensure this table remains static as we bring it across. We're looking to retrieve the value in the second column, so we type 2, and finally we can click FALSE. Therefore, we're provided with a bunch of uppercase characters. To include lowercase characters as well, we can incorporate the following if statement. If the text case is upper, then we want Excel to retrieve the uppercase of the character provided. If not, then we want it to retrieve the lowercase. Now that we have all the characters adjusted for the text case, we can enter the password sheet and use the concatenate function to bring the characters together and return the random password as a whole. To do this quickly, enter equals concatenate and press down the control key while selecting all of the characters. So there's our random password. Do note that since we pasted only the values of our random numbers earlier, our password will not update. If you do, however, want it to update, simply skip the step of pasting only the values. As always, please give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and subscribe to the Excel Hub for weekly Excel tutorials, techniques, and examples.